guys welcome back uh, so today I'm going to be doing some Christmas baking for you guys I'm super stoked I haven't baked in a while so it's the Saturday before Christmas so I thought it would be perfect to kind of bake some cookies and then I've been seeing a lot on like when I'm scrolling through Pinterest just like a lot of different like cupcake ideas and um, I always like to think I'm going to do more than what I actually can like take on. Um, but I think it'll be fine doing just like sugar cookies and cupcakes. So I'm going to have you guys kind of um, come along with me as I like decorate them and do them. And I kind of will also um, just kind of give you like an in on like how I do everything. Um, I have like baked for a while. I love baking. I kind of made a business of it like in high school. I used to bake cakes like all the time for people. Um, insert my favorite one right here. It's the unicorn cake that I absolutely love I made this one a few years ago for someone um but just now that I'm like working and everything I don't really have time to make cakes as like a side gig anymore which is unfortunate but I do get to make them um during like the holidays and I'm gonna make one for Christmas Eve so I will show you that but anyway anyways how did I just say it and it anyways Today I'm going to be baking, so that's what I'm going to do with you guys. I think I might make the um, cupcakes right now because I'm just going to make like mini cupcakes. Are you making them for someone? No, I was just going to make like mini cupcakes. I was going to make like a half batch. Okay. Or so we just for? Just for like us. Okay, I changed my mind. I'm going to make so normal sized one? cupcakes. Yeah. I just want this. Yeah, because I guess yeah. I bought you one, didn't I? Okay. Um, let's see if I can reach this. Is it there? Yeah. Okay. Got it. Joy of cooking. Best cookbook ever. <laughs> Okay, the cupcakes are in the oven now, but I wanted to show you guys. So last weekend I went to Bronner's, which is like the world's largest like Christmas store in Michigan. Um, and I've never been there before, so it was my first time going and I was in like Christmas heaven. I loved it. So um, when I was there, I got some ornaments, which I want to show you. Oh, wow. Show you guys. So when I went there, these are the ornaments that I bought myself. This one is um, backwards. But um, I needed to catch up. If you guys watched my um, Christmas decorating like vlog, you guys saw that when like I said like when I live on my own I have my and I have my own Christmas tree and everything I want to have like this travel tree so it's basically going to be like a Christmas tree that just has like a bunch of ornaments from everywhere I travel to which is why um I already have like my Eiffel Tower which um I showed you guys it was Paris 2018 which is when I went um, during the summer. So, um, I wanted to catch up because I didn't buy any ornaments, like, throughout any of that, uh, like, trip when I went to Europe. So, I wanted to get some when I was there. And Bronner's has, like, a whole entire section for, like, different countries. They had, like, one for England. They had Italy. Um, they had, like, Canada. Uh, just, like, a bunch of just different places. So, I was able to kind of, like, catch up and grab some new ornaments. So, these are the ones that I got. I did get, like, 
um, a globe because I thought this was just like really pretty and it kind of just would go with the like travel tree part of it um, and I really liked that one. Um, this one, so this one I got in the section for Russia but I went to Latvia for a skating competition and one of the holiday markets, we were there like in Latvia like in November so they had holiday markets up and they sold these little dolls. Um, and you guys might have saw, like I showed you guys, the Santa one that we have like this. And that's where we got that Santa one in Latvia. So this reminded me of Latvia, which is why I wanted to get this one. Um, I got this little guy that I can't even manage to pick up. I got this for Venice when I went. I actually went on a gondola ride when I was in Venice, so this one reminded me of that, so I really like that. But I still have to get one for Milan and Bergamo because I also went to those places in, when I was in Italy. And then my last one, I have this one for London. Pretty just like a simple, just like flag, but um, I feel like it's really like representative of it and London like well England in general just like kind of like known for like their flag and they have this a lot on just like stuff um representing it so yeah those were the ones that I got I also have footage from that day. I didn't like vlog the whole entire day that I was in Frankenmuth, but I did like video some of like inside of Bronner's with all of like the ornaments and everything. So I'm going to insert that in a second so you guys can just like get a little glimpse of it if you haven't been to the store yet. That's Bronner's for you, pretty magical and everything. I think now I'm going to actually start the frosting for these cupcakes. So um, I can get started on that. <laughs> for the cupcakes these are just a couple of them but um i ended up making them into just like little christmas wreath cupcakes and they have a peppermint frosting the whitest peppermint with then coconut around it and then just normal buttercream with some sprinkles and piping so yeah that's how they turned out just simple and cute little decoration so it's already 2.30. Um, I think we're just going to do the cookies tomorrow because we've taken like a lot of our day just to bake and we both, like my mom and I, have like other stuff that we want to get done today. So I think I'll just catch you guys up tomorrow with how the rest of the baking goes and you guys will get to see the cookies I made. Hi guys. Um, it's Sunday night and we didn't make cookies today. Uh, day kind of, well, we just really didn't make time to make cookies. Um, it's kind of the end of the day, as you can tell with my hair, is just kind of like, um, whatever it is. I've been getting, like, I have, like, a huge headache today, and I'm sure it's because I literally only had a coffee and a protein cookie all day. So I need to, like, guzzle some water soon, just because... My mom is like screaming, I think, at the TV. I don't know. Anyways, end of the day, it's been a long day. You guys didn't get to see cookies today, so you'll get to see cookies another time. But I figured since we kind of still go on with like this holiday theme, I did finish my shopping for my mom today, which very happy about. What is she saying? I feel like she's trying to talk to me right now, but. I don't know what she's trying to say. What are you saying? Better be able to guess. 
Oh, she's talking about the TV. She's talking... <laughs> bro, bro, she's talking about... Bro, like I... Sorry, did not mean to say that. I just like that naturally. That just kind of um, comes out of my mouth. Um, she, she's asking dad, my dad, what her favorite Christmas movie is. And my dad doesn't know. What, I mean, what a shocker. Um, I'm sure she thinks like The Sound of Music is coming on. That's her, like her favorite. Next to Polar Express. She loves Polar Express. Anyways, I'm going to show you guys what I got my mom because you guys already know what I got my dad and you guys already know what I got my brother if you guys watched previous vlogs. So, today, what I did because um, I was really trying to focus on like supporting local businesses and everything uh, this season just because like they really need the support and everything with what's going on. So, I figured why not shop for my mom from those like shops because I usually go shopping with her on the weekends to these places anyways so it was like great spot to go so um what i did is i ended up going to downtown royal oak they have a, a lot of cute shops there um some of the shops like they have um rail and anchor pataya um right impressions those are some of the ones i hit today and then they also have some others down there that i can't name off the top of my head but um great just little places to shop you can always grab like coffee they have coffee down there and like tons of restaurants and they have um tents outside you can like eat at if you want to eat but um anyways i've been trying to show you guys the stuff that i bought for her and finally getting to that so i'm going to first start with the things that i got from rail and anchor so i just got like like small little things and they're just like cutesy knickknack like unique things that I thought were super cute but my mom loves her LaCroix sparkling water and they had these socks and they say La Queen on them and I thought they were just like so punny and cute for her she like always wears socks and I was like she'll get a laugh at that opening it up so I was like they're just kind of like funny to get her um she loves chocolate so I got her this like cold brew coffee dark chocolate bar um there um and i thought you know that's another like little thing that i can kind of just put together for her i kind of wanted to do just like several gifts together because i couldn't really think of like a big thing i wanted to get her so those are kind of just like little things um so that's like all i got from rail and anchor oh my gosh my parents are yelling at me watch 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 me be right and my dad could not guess the movie <laughs> did i not tell you that my mom was screaming because this movie was on was i i was so right i heard you screaming in the you knew what movie it was yeah but he didn't <laughs> what movie did you guess oh my god everything <laughs> all christmas movies I mean, this isn't technically. I know mom better than you do. How do you feel about that? And you've been married to her for, what, 27 years? Well, there's a newlywed game on this question. <laughs> Anyways. What? We're going to continue with the gifts. Okay, moving on with the rest of my mom's gift. You guys will be hearing them talk in the background, I'm sure, and you guys can hear the music in the background from the movie. But, um, anyways, next place that I went to, I went to Right Impressions, and I found this, um, paint by numbers for adults. And I thought this was a really, really cute idea. So it comes with acrylic paints, a pre-printed canvas, paint brushes, and instructions, and the chart. And then, like, that is the um, painting that she will be making. But my mom has been talking about, like, getting back into painting um, and drawing and stuff just because, like, she used to do that, like, all the time. Um, if you guys can kind of see, like, here. Can it zoom? Okay. We're going in okay you guys can see like those tigers yeah she drew those so um she is very much into like drawing and stuff so am i like i like doing that too but um she's been talking about wanting to get back into it so i thought like this would be just like a great start and kind of something like um not like a gift that i usually get her so i thought it would be pretty cool 
So that's what I ended up getting her for Christmas. I also got her when I went to Bronner's, I got her a snow globe. My dad is whistling the whole entire song to Sound of Music right now. My mom's yelling at him because she wants him to stop. Um, but I, when I went to Bronner's, I also got my mom a snow globe since she collects snow globes. So that's the whole entire gift that I got her for Christmas. Just catching you guys up on what I did for her. Hope she doesn't watch this because um, I don't want her to find out what her gift is before Christmas. So... I'll just tell that too. Oh, how do you solve a problem like Maria? You want to be part of the picture? You suddenly perked up. Hi, you guys. It's a couple hours later. I ended up, um, wrapping all of like my Christmas gifts and everything and making like little tags for them which took me a while because um, I wanted them to be like perfect and I kept on messing up so I had to redo them so it has been a long night of wrapping presents but I finally finished them so here they are I think they're so cute and Christmassy. I love like the wrapping paper that I got. I got it from Michaels. I got like this Merry Christmas one and then this gold one. And then I love like adding little things like um, parts of their gifts and kind of have it like outside of the gift. So like um, this one is for my mom. She gets like a little ornament. My brother, he loves those candy canes. So I got him those. And then for my dad, I found this funny keychain that says, I make money moves. Um, so I thought that would be cute for him. But anyways, I'm going to close out the vlog for you guys here. You guys got a lot of holiday content, um, baking, gifts, wrapping gifts, basically everything, last minute things before Christmas. Because Christmas is in less than a week, which is super exciting. So, yeah. I'm just going to leave it here. I want to go to bed and sleep which sounds great right now so i will see you guys later <laughs> bye